Hi, I'm Warren Domanski. I'm Vice President of Sales in North America for TOGO. We have a product called InSync, which we use uh, with our customers, with the service providers, to provide network visibility and subscriber experience in real time on their networks as they're using the network. About a year ago, uh, we received an order from this large service provider to help them prepare for and execute on their network strategy for the Super Bowl. This was critical because it's such a major event. How did the network perform? How are their subscribers interacting with the network? What did they do during the game? One of the challenges that probe providers have is to be able to manage the huge amount of continuous data that comes at it. We proved through proofs of concepts in multiple markets that we were able to keep up with whatever traffic was thrown at us. We all know that Super Bowl 51, the enormous investment that these uh, service providers provide. Uh, example being adding dozens of new cell sites around the stadium, putting in hundreds of small cells. So the investment is quite large. But they also need to go beyond just providing capacity. And that's where a product like InSync comes in. InSync provides insights into what their users are actually experiencing. Uh, an example would be, I'd like to look at the top 10 applications during the Super Bowl. I'd like to look at something unusual that might be happening around usage during peaks during the game. I would like to know the throughput, the average throughput of my users and my community, you know, my, my subscribers. Um, I'd like to know what, what they're using for resolution on their videos. Is it high definition, low definition? What experience are they, they seeing? With the InSync platform, the, the service provider can look deep into encrypted data which they could not look at before, and they can get these kinds of metrics and then adjust their network to address what's needed to make their user experience that much better. How does a product like InSync enable the deep insights into the traffic set? It does this through using machine learning and heuristics. The, the machine learning is used to identify, to self-identify without a human being. It identifies what the application name is, where it's coming from, what, it, what type of application it is, what protocol it is. The heuristics allow for the modeling to ensure that the resolutions of the video, the quality of it, can be easily identified. With the recent rise in encrypted traffic, those, the, the carriers, the service providers, are left blind not being able to see what's happening within their user's experience around that traffic. Within InSync, we use machine learning to provide complete visibility of encrypted data and data flows. That's critical because more than half the data is encrypted on the network now. And if you can't make sense of that, you can't make sense of how your customers are using the network to begin with. Within Sync, we can explain to our customers every application that's being used on the network, even when they're fully first launched on the network. We can express the speed and the quality of the videos and any aspect of those videos, even if they're buried within an OTT app. For Super Bowl 52, we help them be prepared to address the kinds of things that might hit them during the Super Bowl. You could get a rogue user out there who's using a huge amount of traffic. We can identify that. You can get subscribers that aren't having a very good experience because of unfortunate event that might be occurring. We can identify that. And through this, they're able to then look at not only the volume uh, the volume metrics that are there, you know, how many applications are being used, how, uh, what is the volume of throughput that's going into the stadium, but to drill down further into the actual experience of somebody who's out there for the individual subscriber. Uh, our customer really bought this as a business decision tool to help them make business decisions about how to price their services, how to model their services, how to package their services. It can be used for Customer care can be used by marketing, can be used by network, uh, and it can be used for special events or video, roaming, Volte assurance. Any of these types of applications is, are suitable for InSync. The beauty of InSync is that it's very flexible. You can build your own dashboards. So the service providers, engineers, they can build them into anything they want it to look like, with multiple quadrants, with pie charts, with timelines, so that they can then see further into what's influencing that piece of the pie. It was so interesting to see the network activity 
during spikes and really exciting events and really big things on the field. Um, we saw Twitter take off and Facebook take off and it was just really a neat event for all of us to see the, 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 the play on the field and the network immediately react to that. It was a lot of fun for everyone. We can do this for Super Bowls. We can do it anywhere, any day, any time, for special events or anywhere else on the network. We provide complete visibility end-to-end -end in real time for applications we know about now and applications that we haven't even identified yet. We'll find those for you in real time and, and tell you what they are. Congratulations to the Philadelphia Eagles for a fantastic win in Super Bowl 52.